be doing another YouTube video today. Sorry about like my appearance right now. I'm like freezing. It's very cold where I am. But I think I, I like it a lot. I mean, it looks kind of 90s throwing it back with like the backwards hat and my uh, flannel shirt, you know. If you guys haven't told by the title, yes, I was on TV. Why well, was I on TV? Uh, well, obviously I'm a celebrity, so that's why I was on TV. No. I was on TV because I was part of the Super Bowl 50 halftime show. Pretty cool, right? I was technically a fake fan, more of a rehearsed fan. How did that come to be? How did that how does that how does that happen? How does Aaron Random Girl of the Year get that job? So I'm here to tell you how it all came to be, how it happened. Well, my friend Chloe, who I did a video with, like, just this past week, she interns, I don't know what exactly she does, but she does it, and she told me that she can bring a group of people into the halftime show and be fake fans. Now, I was like, yes, I gotta go. Now, if you didn't know, the Super Bowl 50 was in Santa Clara in California, and I'm from New Jersey, so it was ways away. But, uh, Chloe goes to school in San Francisco, so I flew all the way over to San Francisco, stay with her for a week, and rehearse for the Super Bowl. Now, how I got on TV. <laughs> Basically, we had to rehearse for this event. I knew, sorry to spoil anything, I knew where the camera was gonna be. <laughs> a lot of us knew where the camera was gonna be. But, where we were, we were very lucky where we were put, like, our little squad of people. You know who you are. We were on the front walkway of the stage where Beyonce, Bruno Mars, Coldplay walked down a bunch of times. So we were very lucky, very fortunate to be standing there. But what we had was, which was really cool, was the camera guy, when Chris Martin came down the aisle, he would come to us and we would all jump on him like, Oh my god, Chris Martin! The camera guy would come out and he would pan out and he'd be right there. But I didn't know! <laughs> on the Super Bowl day was that he was going to be right behind my head and basically there is a viral video going around I mean it's not that viral, I mean I'm not like Alex from Target or anything it's like a video of me with my face like blocking the camera cause like I didn't know the camera was right there and I was trying to find it and all of a sudden I looked to my left and the camera's right there and I was like oh my god and I saw myself on the big screen and I'm like Everyone's gonna see that at home. <laughs> and there's another part uh, in the halftime show where I'm like jumping around like a lunatic. I'm like, eh, yeah, you get it, Copa, you know how to do it. So where I come from, I come from a very, very small, small town. Literally during the show, I was getting texts flooding in. I just saw you on TV, you were on the Super Bowl. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, it was crazy. I never felt so famous in my life. <laughs> it was so awesome and it was such a great experience like it was like a once in a lifetime thing. I definitely want to thank my friend Chloe for giving me this opportunity. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you saw me on the Super Bowl. If you did let me know in the comments. So yeah, thanks for watching and have a good day. Ooh. I hear Jerry's